Okay, I'm going to give this a try. I don't know how this will work, but if you're trying to find the negative log of H plus concentration to find pH, sorry, if you're trying to find pH or you're trying to find pOH, here's how you put it in your calculator. So if I have a problem that says I have a molarity of 0.273 molarity of HCl, that's an acid, so you're going to use the negative log. So you're going to do um, push the negative button on your, sorry, i got to turn it on. Push the negative button on your calculator, hit the log button, and then type in your concentration, 0.273, close your parentheses, and your pH will equal 0 0.564, 0 0.564, okay, which would be an acid. Now, what if I had a, a concentration of 2.7? 3e to the negative 3, and that's my molarity of HCl, okay? So how would I do this? Well, I still would do negative log 2.73, but then I have this e, or times 10, remember these two things, to the negative 3. So I would have second, the x minus 1 button to get the e. I would hit the negative and the 3 and close it up, and then I have a pH of 2.56. Okay, so that's how you do these two things. Now, when you do a negative log of a base, which would be, let's say I have a molarity that is, uh, let's say I have a, uh, let's just even do 7.3 molarity of an NaOH. Well, that's a base, so you're going to use the, that pOH, okay? So you're going to take negative log. You're still going to plug in 0.73, close your parentheses, and your pH is going to be, that ain't going to work, sorry. Let me go back. Let me scratch that. Let's do a 7.3 e to the negative 9, okay? Molarity. Only reason because I know it won't match up. So you have negative log 7.3, second button, x minus 1 to get the e, negative 9, and your pH, your, uh, sorry, pOH. No, I had it right the first time. Okay. This would be your pH. Take that back. pOH. Just scratch this one because I'm going to restart because I had the wrong numbers. I do want 0.73. You'll see why in a minute. Molarity of NaOH. I had some, my brain wasn't working. Sorry. Negative log 0.73. Close your parentheses. You get a pOH of 0.14. The pOH is 0.14. 0.14 because the only thing you can find from a hydro from a base is a pOH. If I wanted the, to find the pH of this, then I would take x plus my pOH, x plus pOH, which is 0.14 equals 14. So you would take 0.14 from both sides. So you take 14 minus 0.14 and my PO, my pH pH would equal 13.86, which is a base because bases have to be higher than 7 on the pH scale. Acids have to be lower than 7 on the pH scale, and we only have one scale. Okay, But the only thing you can find from a concentration is pOH on a base, a pH on an acid. Okay, So that's how you put those in the calculator. But what if I have this pH, let's say I have this pH, which is 2.56, and I want to know my concentration of your H+. Plus. Well, then I want to know my H plus here. So how do I put this in the calculator? Because I'm going to use that one. So it's opposite. So on your calculator, 
you would hit second log. And you can see, if you hopefully you can see that 10 to the little caret. Then you have the two, it's going to be a negative 2.56 because it's to the negative pH. And you end up with a concentration of 0, 0.0. But we also, we always put these in scientific notation. So it would be 2.75e to the negative 3, which is basically what we had up here. Okay. Now, the same would go here. You'd put it to the negative pOH. So these are basically the same formulas. Okay. So I hope that helps put this in your calculator. All right.